Good morning. We're in a fairly sunny but fairly chilly Reykjavik in Iceland. It's looking very nice. Looking forward to going out today. We're going to go up to the buffet, grab a bite to eat and then we're off out. We're on the golden shower tour. <laughs> it's not the golden, golden circle. So we're on the golden circle tour, and it's an official Celebrity Cruises excursion. But it's a pretty standard tour that you do on every visit here, isn't it? I there, think so. There will be yeah. an excursion of this type um, visiting the same places. This is lovely. The scenery is absolutely stunning, isn't it? I mean, look at that, how lovely and uh, serene does that look? Until you look around this side and then you realise that we're having to constantly jostle for position. <laughs> it's, um, yeah, it's lovely, it's just busy. Lots of tours and lots of travellers. Look at the scenery, it's fantastic. And look at all the people up there. <laughs> um, yeah, we're going to carry on down. It's a 20 minute walk from top to bottom. Coach is going to meet us at the bottom. There are a lot of crowds of people. Yeah, it's actually better than I expected. The scenery, I think. The scenery is fantastic. It's definitely worth seeing. Um, it's just that there, there are certain spots where people see that photo opportunity and it just <laughs> gets mental, doesn't it? But, uh, but even some of the scenery on the way here was lovely, all the mountains. Yeah. Yeah, it's lovely. It is lovely. We're lucky with the weather as well, because it's sunny. We've got a bit of sunshine, yeah. No rain at the moment. Is that bowl of soup big enough? <laughs> We've stopped for lunch and, yeah, soup first. Mm. Oh wow, that's delicious. Really salty really salty but really delicious fish course looks absolutely stunning <laughs> yeah I know you don't see it very often it's all phones isn't it I know yeah so we're at the golden waterfall and it's stunning isn't it the sun keeps coming out so we're getting rainbows off the waterfall might be a little bit shadowy shadowy figures in front of the geezer <laughs> we've just watched the geezer explode that was awesome I got it in a little bit of slow motion so hopefully that looked quite good uh, timetable is pretty tight so we haven't got long here but that's pretty standard sort of excursion type stuff in it really I'll so. tell you what I can't believe how freaking warm it is I was kind of anticipating really cold weather and pouring down with rain So we've just had a little tour of the power plant, the power plant that utilises the geothermic water from underground. Um, yeah, really interesting. Uh, it's pumped down into Reykjavik 
um, weren't allowed to take any video inside. I got a couple of shots for outside um, <laughs> at, uh, where all the steam's coming out, but yeah, really interesting actually. And they have a reference in Sweden saying, yeah, go to Hakla, that means you have been to a bad place or hell or been through a very bad place. So we've come into the Tuscan main dining room. Just having a look at the menu. There's some nice looking stuff on there. And there's some Tuscan exclusives. Starters have arrived. Kirsty's gone for the garden salad. Kirsty went for the veal chop, which I understand is on all of four of the main dining room menus. I, on the other hand, went for one of the Tuscan dining room exclusive options, which is the pork chop. We're just sailing away, just filming a bit of the sail away. That was a very, very nice meal down in the Tuscan restaurant. Really, really enjoyed that. So we're down in the theatre, we're going to watch this Elton John tribute act, looking forward to it actually. Issa Fjordal we are tomorrow, we have no plans, so we'll see you there bright and early in the morning. Good morning, another very sunny sailing. We're sailing into Issa Fjordal this morning. Some pretty impressive mountains for this sailing. It is chilly though, with this infinite veranda window open. Quite a nice view, apart from the pile of dirt down there. The mountain's pretty spectacular, lit up by the sunshine. It's really peaceful out here actually, isn't it? It's lovely, a bit of sun. It's very sunny, but very cold. It's about three or four degrees centigrade. So feeling chilly, but I think we've really lucked out because it's gonna be sunny all day. So no rain is a right result. Breakfast was very nice down in the main dining room. Bit of Eggs Benedict. I had a side of bacon and a hash brown. <laughs> and it was very nice. It wasn't actually too busy when we first went in there. So there's a tour going out, an excursion going out. That is the routine you meet in the club and then everyone's taken from there in groups down through the Grand Plaza and out to the buses. It's really organized actually, works really well. Cappa Cappuccino. We're out in the cold, and it is cold. literally couldn't ask for any better weather than this. How stunning is that? Perfect blue skies. The mountain reflecting off the calm water there. So this is a small 
fishing town on the peninsula, the northwest peninsula. So you can see there's a lot of a lot of fishing vessels in the harbour here, and there's a beach behind me. If you fancy sitting on the beach, it's not really the Caribbean, but it is a beach, and there's snow on the mountains in the distance. Now you don't get that in the Caribbean. This is the Issa Fjordor Culture House. It's not quite open yet. We may have a little visit, we may not. You can see our ship down there. You might not see it very well on this camera, but it is just there. the mountain on this side. Quite steep walking that last bit, quite bouldery, quite gravelly. resorted to carrying our coats now because that sun's so strong. Pretty good, pretty interesting. It's free to get in. You can just go in and have a wander around. The building is actually an old hospital and I found the most interesting aspect of that actually was all the old hospital beds and stuff they've got set up on the top floor. So we were going to stop for a quick drink on the way back. We were hoping that we might pass somewhere. We've only got a couple of hours before we sail away. So uh, yeah, we were hoping we might pass somewhere we could just drop in on the way back. Uh, there was one little place just around the corner there, but it closed at two. <laughs> so uh, we're pretty much back at the ship now. Um, there's not a huge amount that we saw anyway. So we're not going to walk all the way back into town again. We're, the ship's only just here, so we're going to, uh, we're going to get back on board and like I say, a couple of hours we sail away anyway. But it has been a fantastic day. Really enjoyed it. We've come up to the buffet. Surprised it's still open actually. We were expecting just to get a couple of bits of pizza, which is on all the time. But everything still seems to be available and it's well gone three o'clock, 3 p.m. Uh, so uh, yeah, we've got some nice stuff. I have anyway. kirsty has got a few bits of cheese and some various things going on there. I actually went for all the Asian stuff, uh, again, uh, my favourite. So here we are, we've just come up to deck 15 from the buffet. Have a little look at the town from up here on board the ship. It's a really nice place, really nice and easy to walk around actually. Uh, we just get off the ship and walk down that way, all the way around, and we walked all the way up. Um, we actually went up onto that path along the bottom of the mountain. I think it was about, uh, about here. I launched my drone um, just to get a shot of the town and the ship. But yeah, it's, uh, it's a nice, nice place to walk around. You can see some tours coming back in now. There seems to be a, an influx of buses. And you see all the passengers walking along the quayside now. It was quite easy when we got on. We, I think we timed it really well because we were the only ones coming on pretty much. Here we go. You may use cameras and video during this show. 
and we encourage you to use social media to share your experience of our performances across the wider network. Jesus loves you more than you will know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But we need to find out our finale song. So all of you have been voted on the Celebrity app for our finale song. So, does everyone want to find out what our finale song's going to be? Yeah. I think you can do better than that. I said, do you want to find out what our finale song's going to be? Yeah. Our finale song is... We Are The Champions. I've paid my dues Time after time I've done my sentence I committed no crime We've um, decided to come up and get a couple of bits of pizza because it's late and we had a late lunch and we hadn't had pizza yet so we thought we'd try it. Pizza was alright, not going to rave about it wasn't as good as Princesses, definitely. Uh, it was decent though, it was decent and we wanted to try it, but we probably won't try it again. Um, <laughs> it's just convenient, isn't it? convenience food. The show was good. Um, it's subjective, isn't it, entertainment, so uh, I'll let you make your own mind up. But it was that cast's first show. Uh, they'd never done a show at sea before. They've only rehearsed on land and that was their first one at sea, so pretty significant for them. Uh, and it was, it was good. Good show. Excellent day today. Really nice and sunny. We were lucky. We were really lucky. Really lucky. lucky. It's not going to be as nice tomorrow, I don't think. Um, in fact, we might have some white stuff come down. Because <laughs> it's bloody freezing, isn't it? Yes, it uh, is. <laughs> so, anyway, so we're going to get in. So thanks for watching today, and we'll see you in the morning. <laughs>